In Space Sector 1417, Tarkus Wynn was the lantern in charge. His mission was to save a planet that was in danger because its star was about to explode. He thought he had some time, but things went wrong. When he got to the star, it didn't explode like he expected. Instead, it turned into a black hole right in front of him. He was almost sucked in when a voice said, We have him. A moment later, his power ring, which helped him in his job, said he was gone, and it started looking for a new lantern. So in short, Wynn's mission didn't go as planned, and he was replaced by a new lantern. On Earth, Captain Hal Jordan, a skilled pilot, was testing a fighter jet. To his surprise, Guy Gardner, another Green Lantern, joined him in flight. Hal didn't use his Green Lantern ring while flying. Guy explained that the Guardians had summoned them to Oa, the Green Lantern Corps' headquarters. Hal had recently been there, and learned that he and Jon Stewart were the Lanterns for Sector 2814. He told Guy to go ahead while he finished the test. At the Justice League's watchtower, Kyle Rayner, another Lantern, informed the team of his departure for Oa. Superman, Wonder Woman, and Martian Manhunter wished him well. Jon Stewart reminded Kyle of Kilowog's wisdom, everyone is someone's alien. But then, Batman noticed Guy's immature behavior. Guy, true to form, was teasing Batman. Kyle left, frustrated by Guy's antics, and headed to Oa with Guy, who promised to bring some fun to the mission. Together, they set off leaving the Justice League to protect Earth and the universe. On the planet Korugar, Dr. Saranik Natu was performing a delicate surgery when a bright green light filled the room. She was surprised to see a green lantern ring, a powerful tool used by heroes. Saranik hesitated at first, thinking of its connection to past villains. But when her patient's life was in danger, she had to use it to save him, shocking her colleagues. On the planet Ran, soldier Voth Sarn received orders to get help for his squad under attack. Suddenly, a green lantern ring appeared, choosing him to join a special group of protectors. Vath tried to use it as a weapon, but it only disarmed his enemies. Then, the ring took him to a distant place called Oa. Meanwhile, on Ran, a ship carried prisoners to face punishment. Izumut Cole, one of the prisoners, confessed to a past act of bravery, saving lives but breaking a rule. He faced execution, but a green lantern ring stopped the axe, making him a new member. Izumut used the ring's power to free himself and leave. These three unlikely individuals were chosen by the Green Lantern Rings, setting them on a path of heroism and challenges across the universe. On Oa, Kyle and Guy saw that many new Lanterns had joined the Corps. Some old Lanterns got their rings back too. They all gathered in a big hall, where Kilowog explained their new duties. During questions, Saranik Natu asked how to leave the Corps. Salak, the keeper of the Book of Oa, told her there were three ways, quitting, which was seen as giving up, dying, which was considered honorable, or doing both, which was seen as foolish. Natu chose to quit, because of the bad things the Corps did on her homeworld. She left, and some veterans thought she was making a mistake. Surprisingly, even Guy Gardner understood her feelings because he'd seen similar anger with Katmatui. But Kyle believed Natu was leaving because she was scared. As the Corps continued its work, each Lantern faced their own challenges and decisions, shaping their journeys and the Corps' future. Back at the Green Lantern headquarters, Salak tells Guy he'll help Kilowog train new Lanterns. Guy gets upset and goes to the Guardians. He bursts into their meeting and says he's not meant to train rookies. The Guardians stay calm and tell Guy that if he does well, he might get a different job. Kyle then joins the conversation, using a more diplomatic approach. The Guardians listen because Kyle played a big role in bringing back the Green Lantern Corps. They stop talking about the Lanterns and discuss what's happening in the universe. The Ranthanagar War is spreading, and even the Guardians' old enemies. The Cyan are getting involved. The Guardians also notice that Saranik Natu has left, but suddenly, her signal disappears. Natu finds herself in a dark, strange place. Looking at the remains of someone named Tarkus Wynn, she tells herself not to be afraid. Guy was getting ready to leave Oa because he didn't want to train new Lanterns. But then Kilowog asked him to stay. Kilowog seemed different, and he admitted he was scared. He said the universe was going to change. Guy decided to stay and help because he knew the new lanterns needed good training, especially in a changing universe. 